Well, welcome to the sideboard one last time here at the StarCityGames.com Modern Open in Annapolis, part of the SCG Tour, brought to you by Twitch and Ultimate Guard. I'm Nick Miller alongside our champion, Michael Olson. Congratulations. Hey, hey, thank you so much. Handshake, a little bit of hardware Woo! to go with it. Oh, You're baby. Very excited. You had a, a tough road to the finals yeah. and uh, a tough matchup in the finals, of course. You know, played burn as you're winning in in round 15 you know, and it looked very similar to games two and three of the finals there to reach the, the top eight mm -hmm. uh, but you did not have an easy way so uh, talk about your quarterfinal match and then we'll talk about the epic uh, semifinal match <laughs> so my quarterfinal was against Jim Davis he was on humans um, and normally when the games play out normally they're able to steal game one but uh, you just bring in a few more removal spells and just, you know, you're able to pick off all the kind of the pesky ones and normally game two and three are a little bit smoother. Um, I got pretty low with uh, Dark Confidant and uh, he had to go. He had to uh, take a fatal push from your team, but Knocked at that point right you had already drawn plenty of cards yeah. uh, from Dark Confidant, so you were able to handily take that. The human uh, going against the tribe there, uh, Jim was not a fan. No, but, no. Uh, he called him a traitor. Yeah, semifinals, uh, Tron. Not a good matchup for the Jun deck, uh, but anyone who saw the beginning of that game, I think we tuned in after the restart. Uh, things weren't looking good for the Tron opponent there. You had him pretty low. Tron was doing its thing. Karn had to restart the game. He started with a Liliana and a land in play, uh, yep. as well as a fetch land that, of course, didn't do anything. Uh, yep. What did you think going into game 1.2? So 1.2, I kept a one lander. It was a stomping ground with a bolt. And I was like, all right, I'm already pretty low chance to win a resolved, like restart the game. So I'll keep a one lander and I'll keep a way to kill the Liliana if he doesn't activate it, because that gives me like the best chance. And I uh, just was able to do Dark Confident on turn two and then just kept going on. Right, uh, you know, he had already mulliganed, so he didn't want to up Liliana at that point. You were able to take it out on the first turn, and then the Maelstrom Pulse took out all oh, the, the tokens, yep. and then from there you, you got it, and then a bunch of Fulminator Mages got you to the finals. Burn, you, uh, you played your opponent there round 10 earlier this morning, correct? Yeah, so he steamrolled me uh, in round 10 today. I came into day two, eight and one, felt really good about today. Uh, but he just rolled me over. You know, when Jun doesn't put a clock on uh, Burn, they just get you out faster. Got your revenge in the finals, though, and uh, you're a Jun player for a long time. So, was there any consideration coming into the vis into this event? You know, what style you would play, any certain cards, or um, so KCI and um, has has really picked up, um, and so you kind of really want to kill your opponent faster. Um, everybody still underestimates how fast Tarmogoyf like gets in there, um, and Bloodbraid helps kind of like push you over the edge. I've tried. Uh, Tireless Tracker builds, uh, and that's really good when there's a lot of humans, when you want to keep drawing a lot, a lot of cards. Uh, Dark Confidant is a real liability to that. Um, but I like I like Tireless Tracker, but he had to go to the side. She had to go to the side for a little bit. Right, KCI has been on the rise, but uh, this event, you know, as you mentioned, humans was the kind of the top dog in the metagame. Didn't see that one coming. Your deck still has a ton of removal spells yeah. at the end of the day, and I think that was kind of the name of the game. That's true. Uh, any Final thoughts or shout outs here? You're the champion. Uh, big shout out to uh, Raven's Nest, to Wind Condition, um, and all the people back home uh, and all their support. All right, Michael, congratulations. I'm going to send that over to Ryan Mathias one last time here in Indianapolis.